Long story short, it's uh, middle of February, 35 degrees, which is unusually warm for that part of the year. Uh, and we're heading for an off-road rally. But no, no, not in a slammed BMW 335 I'm sitting at the moment. No, we're going to use Steyrbuch Pinsgauer 17N. Prepare to be amazed. And here's the truck in question. It's a 46 years old Steyr Puch Winsgauer 710N. Army truck from Austria, produced in the same factory that produced the very famous Fiat Panda 4x4 drivetrain. And this truck was designed to carry troops in the Alp regions. That's not exactly famous for a fantastic infrastructure, especially in the military applications. This truck is one of the most uh, offered capable in a stock form ever produced on the planet. It features 2.5 litre inline 4 air cooled engine, supposedly designed by Porsche. I need to research the topic uh, further, but as you can see, it's just one hell of a beast. More on that a slightly later. Oh, and by the way, uh, this will be my office for today, as I'm being, con yeah, very conveniently being carried as a luggage. Yeah, not bad. Around 200 cars, some heavily modified, <coughs> some nearly stock. So there's four classes and yeah the weather is pretty decent so that should not be any major disaster. Okay, so I'm in a petrol station uh, because uh, over the last uh, 45 miles we've lost around a quarter of a tank that I need to calculate but I think the MPG of a truck is around 6 MPG or something like that. Uh, yeah, so it's not exactly a Prius. Uh, but the other fun uh, thing is that uh, I went, yeah, pretty much to wash my hands etc and the truck disappeared so the guys, uh, yeah. Forget about me. So, <laughs> yeah, good start, good start. Oh, yeah, the truck comes. Yay, here they come. <laughs> yeah, here's the truck in question, yeah.
done a little rescue mission. This rebadged uh, Nissan Navara or Premier, I guess, uh, on the stock tires. Got it stuck a bit and it's leaning towards a uh, crease. So obviously the heroic Pinskauer needs to rescue this thing. As you can see, it's like one or two inches from the doors and every single move now on a completely stock tires might be pretty interesting, let alone a little expensive. But hey, let's see how it goes. <laughs> Standard situation, brand new truck which is a rebadged Nissan on the stock tires. Uh, the owners got carried away a bit and headed for a off-road rally. <laughs> so now we're moving the pins to a different angle position because obviously that angle was only a recipe for an interesting situation that would be worth several clicks on YouTube if you will and so we're gonna relocate the truck uh, yeah and try to winch it we'll see the damages to the right side but oh, hey doing jeep stuff The objective is to get the stamp, as you can see, it's on the right, right next to the guy in a red. Another point, this is a completely different environment, no mud. This time it's a sandy hill in the middle of a forest. And obviously you see a lot of struggle. Again, people are winching, uh, finding to, fighting to find a point. Locals are observing and uh, wondering what sort of idiots are those guys in the scars. Yeah, the usual stuff. Again, with a Pintawa, it's a pretty boring car to film, to be honest. It's a disappointingly confident. I mean, no drama, no wheel spin, and no revving. Just go.
this place is really steep. Very sandy as well. Uh, as you see, other cars are struggling to get up and they need to winch themselves up. The bins will go down. Nothing to see here, nothing's going on. I think it's pretty boring to film to be honest. <laughs> it just does its job. But it needs to go up, it goes up, and it needs to go down, it just goes down, it goes through the water, it goes through mud, no drama, no engine roar, no wheel spin, no splashing. It just goes through and yeah, nothing happens. Amazing trip. Yet really boring to watch. Okay, so we'll have a little uh, yeah, interesting attempt to attack uh, one of those places where you need to get a stamp. And this slope is really steep, very sandy. And all of those cars, including those heavily modified monsters, struggle up here. I'm not sure whether the truck will go exactly this way or the other way around but it's a pretty difficult place because of the loose sand so we'll see how the bins on the yeah let's be honest very aggressive off-road tires will cope with the environment here is just another day in the office we're in a pins car where we go completely downstairs and above us we see a ATV hanging on a winch yeah like a one or two levels above us <laughs> yeah looking pretty good <laughs> all right yeah that should be interesting We're trying to yeah, move the pins up and it needs to get where I am. But the angle is above 100 percent as you could see the the right wheel okay yeah the right wheel is in the air. Stop! Stop stop! Yeah, the angle is very bad, but it's actually quite funny. So what we're trying to do, we're trying to uh, yeah, basically not flip the Pinskawa on the roof, but actually might happen. It's bloody steep and the right wheel is in the air. should be able to get the truck. Ah, just kidding, you can do anything. Yeah, that's it. Now that's the best part, washing the truck. Kind of cool. An amazing day. <laughs> <laughs> 